Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Uh, it's been a few weeks, uh, a crazy crazy few weeks. Um, I've not been doing very good mentally, physically. Uh, Joanne's not been very well, she's had some issues with her hand. Um, there's an Instagram post about it, I'll link it below. So I thought we'd do something quite upbeat and cheery. So I put this top on, which is probably quite trippy, but it's because it's got orange on. Um, because I'm doing a mm, does my makeup. So uh, yeah, let's go on with that. And so uh, yeah, let's go on with that. And this is what we're going for: an orange, red, yellow sort of upbeat look. Um, this is from a girl called Kia. Um, she used to do Winter Guard with me. Uh, lots of dancey sort of stuff but use flags, rifles, sabres and stuff sounds crazy um, but you know if you don't know what it is it's, it's hard to explain um, and I, lo I love Kia I've known her since she was about 12 and she's 16 this year so yes we're doing this so we're doing an orange sort of faded into yellow eye with a red lip um, there's nothing been put on the face so I'm just going to do my normal base um, I'm probably not going to mention uh, product in this I'll just list them all below but as always I'm gonna do my brows first I tinted them the other week um, two weeks ago I think so they'll need doing again soon so I've sort of done my brows there um, I've come to notice recently that I can't put brow gel on without getting it all over me <laughs> That this brow has such a nice sort of shape and then this one looks crazy in person but then on camera this one looks so good and this one looks naff is prime my lids so i don't know if anybody saw but posted a picture and my very first tiktok the other day and uh it was in a 90s themed look like space buns sort of grungy look which i loved i thought it was gorgeous um and someone had messaged me on instagram asking if i could do a video on it because they loved it and they want to know how to do it so maybe i will do that over the next few weeks i'm also aware of how crazy my hair currently looks like it's ridiculous oh see, i don't know if anyone can see but i've got like a crusty patch of eczema and it's really annoying me also if i'm like hunching or in a weird position it's because um all night on saturday i was up every 15 minutes being sick um it was sort of self-inflicted but unintentionally um i'd had a drink or a few and uh so I felt drunk but I came home took my normal tablets as usual because usually I'm fine like whatever you know I can sort of just be careful as I know sort of like if I've drank a certain amount I shouldn't take my tablets but like I felt okay I felt drunk but I was like it's fine my tablets will be fine I forgot that one of the tablets I've been taking recently is like a long-term antibiotic so um yeah it was not a good look <laughs> it really really badly reacted with the alcohol and i was spewing all night my floor was bright yellow because i'd barely eaten so i was just bringing up bile so i pulled muscles in my chest my ribs and all down my back and it's very painful not a fan <laughs> um so oh i don't know what color to start with I'll start with the yellow so I'm looking at this and I don't know whether I should do one orange and one yellow and orange or one or both of them the same I don't know I might do both of them the same because that's just what I do I don't know we'll see we'll I, I don't know, I might do one completely orange. So 
I thought while I film this video we can have a little bit of a catch up because obviously I've not seen you guys for a couple of weeks because um well I've been feeling crap <laughs> so uh how has everyone been? I evidently have not been great or I would have been here making videos um there's been a lot of stuff going on not even just like physically like mentally I've had a lot going on obviously it's nothing that I've come out and talked about openly with anyone so uh, I'm not I'm not gonna get into it because you know we don't need to it's not something that I am sort of ready to put out there yet just before anyone asks because this is the thing I always seem to get I'll say like I'm excited about something or I'm nervous about something or I feel sick which is a common thing in my life I'm always excited nervous well more nervous or feeling sick and I always get asked if I'm pregnant I am not just putting it out there like literally it's impossible right now so uh yeah there's been a lot going on as I said Joanne's had some issues she had to have surgery on her hand uh, I have been going through a lot mentally, physically I've not been doing great either so it's been a crazy couple of weeks of just feeling a bit naff so uh, I've not really done anything like I've done bits of makeup here and there but really only if I've needed to yeah so I've, uh, I've not really done a whole lot it, it's been very sort of oh well you feel crap so you look crap and all of this and it's just it's not been good i've not liked it i don't know whether to go like orange into red on this eye no well, should we stick to orange we'll do plain orange but we'll do more of a smoky orange I've not really spoken to anyone or done anything it has literally been like I've not wanted to speak to anyone or see anyone I've, I've spoken to my family obviously they're, they're my family why did I just put yellow on that brush so uh, really all we've done is dramas in hospital so I rearranged all my drawers so my makeup was in the big drawers and now it's in the small drawers um, I sorted out lots of stuff like um, I put a quote on my mirror it says life is tough dear but so are you put some more vinyl stickers on things um, my hair drawer went from my bottom drawer of my big drawers to my two smaller ones so it's been sort of lots of chopping and changing because I've just wanted to it sounds corny saying like have a fresh start but that is been it essentially I've just sort of wanted to get rid of all the crap going on in my life and just be like Do you know what I want to have fun and you know be a happier person because recently uh, recently I've just felt crap and it's like I, I feel miserable and I don't want to be miserable and it's not because of anything in particular it's just I've had so much going on and then with Covid not being able to see my family I've had some pretty sad sort of stuff like um it's been it was the birthday of the little girl that I miscarried the other day um it's my sister's birthday the other day so it's like things have been happening it's been like mm, okay well you know you don't get to see your sister for our birthday and you don't get to do this and that so I've been a, a bit sort of defeated I think is the word and drained I've really not wanted to do anything so today like the other day Sunday I washed my hair planted it so it's now nice and wavy um, I've dry shampooed it and stuff so it sort of stays so it might not be as nice as it was the other day but I thought I wanted it like that for this video but I should probably wash it tonight 
and then honestly I'll probably plant it again and have it like wavy again um, but today Joanne and Louise popped out to pick up some stuff and they had to go shopping um, they had to get Louise's uh, meds from the pharmacy so I was having cuddles with the dogs did my nails give myself like a little French manicure and uh, just sort of had a bit of me time which sounds stupid like oh me time you you know you should be happy with your wife and want to spend all your time with your wife I'm very 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 happy with my wife um, I just don't want to spend every second with her because I feel like she'd want to punch me <laughs> no she would never punch me but you know I know I can be annoying and overbearing I need time for me to sort of calm down and get out of my own head so it's sort of like good for both of us to just have a bit of time on our own you know she got time with her mum I got time on my own with the puppies you know and the puppies are I love them though Susie's been very grumpy today but uh, you know, been, been a crazy couple of weeks um, so that's my eye makeup done for the top of my eyes um, I'm going to use a little bit of liner oh do you know what I'm going to do actually oh no I am going to take a cotton bud and I'm going to do a little bit of like a brown liner look but I want it to be smoky I know it's weird I do this with a cotton bud but then I make sure it's not like too much pigment and I can sort of blend as I go so that is my shadow done I'm gonna do my base so I'm just gonna prime before I do my foundation and then I'll do my under eyes and mascara etc etc I just fully like smacked my brush off my mirror oops look how great this is honestly thought this colour was going to be awful when I first looked at it but it's quite nice like it's obviously like darker than my neck but I can literally get if I get a foundation the same colour as my chest I look pink so you know not doing that um, concealer <laughs> my smile lines are getting so deep I feel old like oh so I am gonna quickly set under my eyes and literally just under my eyes because otherwise I will crease and I do not want any creasage um, I'm gonna do a little bit of blush and this is the first time I've used this blush this one is the elf putty blush in Turks and Caicos honestly got this because of Manny MUA I've not used a putty bl blush, I don't think ever. But I've used quite a few cream blushes and really enjoyed it. So I'm just taking a little bit on a dense sort of brush and just patting that on. <laughs> is gorgeous I really like that it doesn't look like 
there's anything like on my skin when you look at it but uh, there is I promise um, so now I'm gonna go oh crap that was a lot and set the rest of my face and I'm not like using a lot of powder I'm using a mini so um I'm having to pick up more than I would if I use like a full size product because the uh, the pan's tiny and just do my ears and my neck and around my nose because that's where I get oily um, I'm gonna take my butter bronzer by Physicians Formula just on my temples and my cheeks um, and I'm just using my powder brush and just using a bit of uh, cream, uh, powder blush on top of that cream one just so it didn't get lost underneath everything looking at myself in this mirror thinking oh my god why am I so big and then noticing that I'm using my magnified side of the mirror um, and now I'm going to do my under eye So I've just done the same colours as on top, like just the orange ones this side. I pull such unattractive faces when I'm doing my lower lash line. I'm, like, I'm just going to spray my face using set and spray quickly. Like literally the smallest amount. Glowy, I am. I love it. Um, so I'm gonna curl my lashes. Obviously, in art, you get taught the color wheel and stuff, and like what complements things with blue eyes, orange shadows look amazing, like orange and bronzy colors. And I honestly love an orange eyeshadow look. Because I was looking through. Oh, pun pants. I went to say bugger and pants at the same time, then and punts came out. I um was going through all the makeup, like the face charts I've got, of like friends and family that have drawn looks for me and my last few looks on the channel have been quite dark blue, dark purple, black lips or dark purple lips and stuff and I was thinking I don't I don't want to do that again so sort of looking through at what I could do and I saw this and I was like oh my god yellow, orange and red is perfect so now for my lips I'm just gonna get a bit of this foundation and whatnot off now I can't find my rip lip liner I don't know if it's meant to be like rest in peace liner or just rip lip uh, by house labs which is um, in supermodel which is red I can't find it, I don't know where I've put it, which is stupid. I must have dropped it the other day um, when I was getting stuff out of my drawers. So I'm using this one from Avon. Um, it's an invisible lip liner. Which sounds crazy, but it, it does help. Oh, I couldn't tell you if it helps because it does something or whether it helps because it it's sort of like placebo effect like you you think oh I've put a lip liner on so you know I'm good but I don't know if I've 
never use this lipstick, you know. It's quite nice. <laughs> is this look complete I know this one's not quite as yellow but there is yellow in there I promise what are we thinking let me take my hair down so I don't look quite as crazy as I do currently well, I might do actually I might look even crazier because my hair is uh, crazy I want my natural hair to look like this I love this crazy messy hair what do you think I like it I think I did good. Kia, what do you think? You'll have to comment and let me know. But that is this video complete. I hope you like this look as much as I do. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with all your friends. You know, that would help massively. Um, I will put links to all my social media and whatnot in the bar in the bio in the description uh remember check my tiktok you know there might be more than one on there by the time you look and uh, i will see you next week there's my air freshener <laughs>